the goal for me was to unite the campus and unite it around a common calling, a common purpose that was bigger than ourselves, kind of service before self. I continue to think about that. How could we bring two zip codes, three buildings, all of this diversity together, and how could we unite? So that was the, the goal, and it was proved to be challenging, but you know, really, it was initiated by students. In spring of 2018, I was named principal here at Clear Lake High School. Didn't start until the fall, but I came over to visit with some of the student groups and visit with some of the teachers to, to kind of let them know who I was and, and to uh, get a feel for the campus itself. Uh, in those meetings, I kind of felt like it was a, a really good time to start pushing character. I will also tell you that uh, I really truly believe that our superintendent placed me here for that reason. The academics here, there's a legacy of excellence uh, that goes a long way. And so academics is in really good shape. I just felt like our superintendent, Dr. Smith, felt like maybe it was time to put me over here with some of the, the, the feelings and philosophies I have on relationships with kids. So the Groundbreakers is a group that the Clear Lake administration put together over the summer just to develop leadership and character and learn how to spread it to others. We think it's very important to have strong leaders who can empower others to be kind, be good citizens, and help build great communities. So last year, around, um, I'd say, November, December, my student council class started planning for this event that we started called Student Council Wonderland. We brought in the local elementary school um, student council members and we taught them different character traits and different, we did different activities such as build gingerbread houses, play snowman related games, and I was a service leader in the gingerbread house area and the focus there was teamwork. Um, teaching the students to work together and that really impacted me in a positive way because I was in student council in elementary school and it was really fun to um, do different activities and I would have loved to do an activity like that when I was in elementary school. I remember these six traits and more positively reinforced to my classmates and I during our character advisory lessons and also on the morning announcements each and every day by our high school principal Mr. Drake. I think the fact that these traits and a good character were constantly reinforced and discussed at Clear Lake held us to a high standard. People noticed when you were trustworthy, when you were caring, when you were being a good citizen, and when you were kind, and when you were fair in sports, and when you were respectful of your teachers and classmates and took responsibility for your actions. Talking about all of these traits held us to a high standard of excellence and performance of good character. So Clear Lake Basketball does a thing where we volunteer um, at our local elementary schools. Uh, we might not be able to do it this year, but we did in the past. And uh, basically what we do is we kind of counsel these at-risk kids using basketball skills, drills, lessons. And um, at the end we all get together and we talk about you know our CCISD car values. It's really cool, we get to have a discussion with these kids, see where they're coming from, and we also get the, an opportunity to work on our, you know, leadership. Um, we we get to, you know, lead the discussion, and I think we're helping these kids out. Sí, yo lo uso mucho como el respeto. Bueno, siempre he tenido respeto, verdad, pero aquí también me, aquí obtuve uh, obtuve más información como tener más respeto contra entre nosotros. En el trabajo lo uso mucho, uh, respetando a todos. Como hay unos que los llaman por apodos, entonces yo los digo por su nombre, entonces el respeto para mí saludar a todos. Character is something these kids can take with them anywhere they go, whether it's on to university, to the military, to the workforce, to their normal lives, everyday lives. It's character is just something that we all need to be aware of, uh, and and that's what that's why it's important to me. 
We're looking at this application as just a, an accolade along the way, but this is not where our journey stops. Uh, we're going to continue. Uh, and of course, I'll be Pollyanna about that. It's when we get 100% of kids on board, that's when, when I'll be satisfied. But I want this, this to be something that continues on here at Clear Lake High School long after I, I leave here.